let us today understand the concept of gram atomic mass. Now atomic mass is something which we have also discussed earlier but for the sake of clarity let me explain this once again. Atomic mass of an element okay let's say for example I will take an example of oxygen. Oxygen has an atomic mass of 16 unit where U basically represents 1 by 12th of carbon 12th atom right or in other words it represents that one atom of oxygen okay is 16 times heavier than the weight of 1 12th of carbon atom right so the atomic mass basically is nothing but the relative mass the comparative mass of an atom of a particular element let's say in our example it's oxygen when compared to the 1 12th weight of a carbon atom now let's also understand the meaning of this term which is getting added to the gram atomic mass now gram is nothing but it's one of the units which is used for measurement of mass and it's one of the most common unit right so let's say for example if you go to the market and you say okay I want to buy cashew or maybe even apples of course apples you might be buying in kgs or kilograms you say please give me 500 grams of cashews so gram is nothing but the unit of measurement of mass right when this atomic mass of an element let's say in case of oxygen is represented in grams it is known as gram atomic mass so let's say if I have to write down the gram atomic mass or gam of oxygen the atomic mass was how much 16 u to convert this into gram we just replace this u okay and put it as grams simple and this is basically nothing but the gram atomic mass of oxygen and this is what is known as gram atomic mass a related concept to this is that of gram molecular mass now since we are discussing this let's also discuss gram molecular mass now even in case of gram molecular mass if we talk about let's say again oxygen only the molecular mass of oxygen is 32 u right where u is again the same thing 1 12th of carbon 12 atom the gram molecular mass of oxygen or for that matter any element is the atomic mass represented in grams and again to do this you just simply convert this into grams right 